Hi guys, today we're going to have another tutorial. As you may have watched my previous tutorial, it's about how to sing the high note like Mariah Curry. So right now, I figured that I'll I'll make another tutorial tutorial video, and this time it's going to be the first step on how to sing the high note like Mariah Carey. Um, I just want things very clear with you guys that we are not trying to sing the high note and sound like Mariah Carey. As I have mentioned previously in my um, first tutorial, I mentioned there that nobody can actually sing the high note and sound like Mariah Carey. I believe that our voice are personal, right? It's not really something that we choose to have a particular voice because many people actually wanted to have a different voice. Whatever voice that we're given, we just need to use it um, however we want, but we can't really change it or sound some something like the other because it's not very sustainable, especially if we're speaking about the high notes because with the low notes, you can still control. There is still a lot of controls that you can do during the low notes, but when it comes to the high note, you have to really give it your all, right? Because your first priority is to have the high note and you can't really modify or control much of the things up there because you have to give it your full power when you're there. This is not about sounding better. Let's try to forget that for now. This is about making our voice sound in the same vibration as her, or yeah, if that makes sense. Many of us doesn't really have thick and big voice. So saying the high note like Mariah Carey is something that we're going to struggle with because some of us just have thin voice, you know. You can tell when you hear the voice when it's thin. I'm doing Mariah cover songs, as you may have heard, and I'm singing the songs not with my natural voice because my natural voice is very low. Like, I can sing mid-range and then I'll be flat because I cannot even hear mid-range songs, you know. So I have to find other sound in my voice where the range is higher. If I will try to go to the high note using my real voice, it's not gonna go very far. It's like this. Uh... Oh. It's it. It's so bad, right? I'm using. I'm not sure how you call it. Is it the head voice or something? I'm going like, ah, something like that. That is how I get to the high note. For us to sing the high note, the first focus is to sing with a thick voice. So if our voice is thin, it's okay. We can try to open our mouth, let our voice come out like, oh. Ah, something like that. If your voice is really small and if you think that your, your voice is so thin, you can try to sing like a man because when you're a man, you're like, oh, you're like that, right? And then after that, let it all out in that tonality. Oh, and then make it louder. Oh, practice that over and over again until you feel a little stable with using that sound in your voice. When you think that it's already thick, like we can try to make it wider. Thick is like this and wide is like this, right? Thickness is oh, wide is oh. I hope I'm making sense. So it's like oh. When it becomes wide, it's like your mouth becomes more open and it takes a little more space from the side. It's hard to describe and to talk about voices because I'm not really sure what are the exact terms to describe them. But when I talk about wide, you can listen to the song All I've Ever Wanted by Murray Carey. And on the bridge there, it's not super high, but it's like the most or the widest voice that you'll ever hear. After the wideness, when going to the high note, we also have to apply the fullness and the weight. The thickness, you can use it when it's low, right? Oh. For you to bring it up and still maintain the voice and not sounding like you're straining it, you have to equip it with fullness and heaviness, like oh. You know, there is that volume there. So, for example, this one. Let's try to listen to one of Mariah's song. For example, like the song Never Too Far, if you know that song. Never too far away. So that doesn't have any fullness or that doesn't have any weight. Far away. 
if you listen to Mariah's how she say the away there, it's thick and there is weight there. There's volume like this. Listen to it. There, right? So if you'd listen closely, she is singing like, Far away! Like it's... I'm sorry guys, my voice is not conditioned, you know. That's the thing with voices, you don't really get to control. Some days it's okay, some days it's not. I actually been waiting to have a real acceptable voice before doing this video, but yeah, I've been waiting forever. So instead of saying, never too far away, she is singing like, never too far away. There is like wideness in that away, right? It's like massive. It's taking a lot of space. Never too far away. I'm sorry, my voice is not full. But yeah, if you understand that is how she sing the high note. I have actually also tried to find some high note that we can try to use an ex as an example in this video. I picked two high notes of Mariah Carey. I'm not sure if you are familiar with these two songs. So the first song. I, I think many people are familiar with that. I'll lead the way. Um, I pick one slow and then a little fast high note. First is the lead the way. On the last part there, there is that high note, but it's slow, right? It's slow. It didn't go quickly to the high note. Let's just try to listen. So, where is that? This one. Did you hear that the third high note? So that's what we're going to learn. The first, the second, and then the third. So when you go to the third, it's like you're digging deeper. Her voice is not like No, it doesn't sound like it's getting thinner when it gets to the third high note. It's getting deeper and wider, actually. It's like... I hope I'm singing it correctly. The third is like... Oh, let's listen to it again. Why is there thunder? Okay. First. Second. And then the third. Right? So. It's going deeper and wider. Right? That is how you differentiate the high note on the right It's not like, no way. Like it's getting thinner now. No way. Okay, so the next one, the next high note, if this one is a little faster. So we have the song. Never forget you. Do you know that song? It's kind of an old song. Not many people are familiar with it, but I'd like to use the example in this song. It's basically the 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 baby in the last chorus before the bridge. Let's just listen to it. So there, because there is a high note on the baby, and then on the last note, she still make it higher. Right. So. There. Other singers would sing it like yeah, 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 to get the high note. The throat is like getting smaller or they have to kind of squeeze it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But no, it has to be open and wide. Yeah, something like that. So again, let's listen to it. There. There. May I, yeah, it's not like May I, yeah, 
no you have to make it open and give it make it full rounded and you know wide again there I'm not sure if I put my point across well or I relay my message well if you get anything from this video but yeah I hope I make sense somehow and I hope that you understand even a little bit of what I'm trying to say when it comes to seeing the high note like Mariah Carey uh, just remember that First, when you are trying to sound different or like experimenting with your voice, you don't have to be perfect. It doesn't even have to sound good. It doesn't have to sound better. Um, sounding better is the last thing that we have to worry about. It's like in the final touches. It's gonna be messy because you're trying to find a new sound in your voice, right? But it's okay. You just have to practice and practice and then once your voice already adopts that uh, thickness that you have found in your voice then you can go ahead and work it trying to make it better and sound better that's all for now if you like this video give it a thumbs up and tell me in the comment section what do you think about this tutorial and what would you want to see more from this channel thank you ciao